let's now draw the crow's foot for the tiny model college that we worked with before. We already have our course text box and our relationship of one to many. We don't have to really create a complete database for this model. Just make sure whenever you work with your relationships that you should use the relationship connector and not any of the categories of parent to child. So now we have our course. Let's do our class. We're going to insert a text box, draw that text box on the mini end, and make sure that we type in our class. Now for this text box, we're going to make it so that we have a background of a particular color. We also want to make sure that we have our boxes pretty much the same so you can resize those. Now when I'm ready to create our next relationship, go to the relationship. We are again working with one to many. We draw our relationship. We make sure that with the relationship selected, we go to our miscellaneous and tell it that our cardinality is one or more. Now if we need to make this bigger, we can by simply extending it. Now that we have our class, we can go to our next text box and make the enrollment. So again, I can insert the next text box. and tell it that we want this one to have our enroll, our one-to-many relationship. Again, we select the text box and tell it that it's going to have an internal color. Now when we're ready for our next, we again, using the correct, correct direction, our one is on our start, our many is on our end. Make sure again that we do one or more, but we have to make sure the relationship tab. Notice how that whenever we have our wrong relationship selected, it goes the wrong way. So I'm going to select this, delete it, say yes, and again select the next one of our one to many. We can now do our last box, which of course is our student. And our student again is showing one to many. Now make sure right here we're showing zero or more. We select our one or more to change the shape. By selecting any of the others, it will change the shape of our connector. So we're doing our last text box. And again, our last one is going to be our student. Make sure it's the correct color. And there we have our relationship showing our course as one to many on the class, our class showing as one to many on enrollment, and our student showing one to many on our enrollment for our classes. There's a lot of different software that we can work with to create these. This image, Visio is made for data modeling. It's made for the modeling. Now, when you're working on these, if your connectors do not show up using the crow's foot model, just make sure in your database, under your options for your document, that you select the crow's foot. If you don't have it selected, they will all turn to arrows. Now we have the crow's foot model for our college, which we worked with in our last video. Continue on.